If there's air conditioning, is there such thing as air shampooing? Shut up! Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? And then we gonna take them all away. Police are ghosts in the long way. Hey, do you mind if I turn the climate control down a little bit? Why? It's gotten a lot warmer in the car, hasn't it? Never really noticed much. You don't feel like it's slowly gotten a lot warmer? No. You're clearly sweating. I always sweat. You know, it's a driving's a very stressful situation. It's not the temperature. It's the, it's the strain of driving. What are these guys doing? Just talk at them. I'll give them like three seconds and then I'll talk. Okay. That was one second. I was counting in Chinese seconds. That's not a real thing. White people. I'm just gonna turn the temperature down. What? No! That's not gonna do anything. It's just gonna blow the same air out harder. We can't change nature, okay? Oh, I get it. You're a climate control denier. What? Yeah, look. As you can see from this graph that I've conveniently prepared prior to this discussion, the temperature in the car has gradually gone up overall. Yeah, I don't agree. What do you mean you don't agree? You can't just choose not to accept the facts. Hey, I can choose to believe whatever I want and then spew my opinion backed up by only anecdotal evidence if I choose to. It's called the First Amendment. You ever heard of it? It's been in America for thousands of years. Oh, why are people so dumb? Keep honking. Honk the sh out of these pink fuckers. I wanna be rude. Okay, so I saw this video on Facebook. This lady was yelling at a guy because he wouldn't move his car. Turns out, the guy was on his phone and had just found out his dog died. Now I always think twice, but I... Okay, just because somebody made one documentary saying you can change the climate control in your car doesn't mean it's true. You just don't know how it works. Yeah, nobody knows how things in their car works. It's just light up buttons and flashy thingies put in by the car companies to make us think that we're paying for something cool and new. No, no, not really. Oh, okay. Uh, do you know how uh, cruise control works? No, but it, it's just... Corporate greed strikes again. Stop! Fine! I'll ask him to move. What the f***? Are you burning a log in here? Yeah, so what? Oh, put it out. It's making it way hotter in here. Dude, I've always done that. You just expect me to change my habits? Why would you even need that in here? Okay, look, let's say I'm going down the road and I wanna cook some bacon over the open flames, you know, give it that nice smoked flavor. You ever thought of that? Okay, let me, let me just put this into words that you might understand. Okay, it's convenient, okay? And if you don't like convenience at the expense of other people's suffering, then you are not a real American, what? What the? What are you guys doing in here? We're trying to solve this climate control issue. It's getting way too hot in here, and if we don't figure it out soon, there's gonna be disastrous results. Yeah! You guys have dual zone climate control. You know you each can choose your own temperature on your own side, right? And the seat heaters are on full blast. Oh. Get real. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, she was cranky. Dude, that girl, woo, anger issues, cranky, right? Cranky, panky. Oh, let's get out of here, man. Bad boys, bad boys, what, what you gonna, gonna do? do? What, what you gonna, gonna do when they come for you? Are you f***ing serious right now? You're illegally parked in a five minute zone. I've been here for like three. Well, technically it's been like nine Chinese minutes. Bison! Yup. Bison, you're the only one that you're the only one that 